coming in from anywhere, I want to show you how it will look as you approach Blacksburg. So right here, you'll see we're on 460. This is the Virginia Tech Fort Research Center Road, 5B. And so you'll see these signs coming up. So, let me tell you a little bit. Thank you so much for tuning in, and welcome home if you're a returning Hokie coming to town. If you're a new person coming to Blacksburg, my name is Chris Saunders. They call me Dr. Moon. I'm the downtown street musician for the last 12 years. So right here's your exit. It says exit 5AB, Blacksburg 460 Business. So at this point, and start to slow down and you'll have two options right here the one that will take you straight on through is to the left and that's where you want to be if you take the right one it takes you up to a street that you turn left and it takes you up to a stoplight that's right up here so either way you'll be able to get downtown if you accidentally turn and went up that road. But this one to the left is the one you want to take. So as you approach this bridge, start to slow down. Traffic is going to merge over on the left. See up here on the hill. And it has a light that slows people down. That light at the top. up here into traffic. Alright, we got somebody from Florida in front of us here and somebody from Radford. So, when you're coming into town, if you're running on empty and you're looking to get gas somewhere, the very first place is going to come up here on the right. It used to be a Wilco, I think it's a Speedco or something. main thing is, it's a gas station. So right here, as you come off the bypass, right here is the Speedway. Speedway station on your right. And this is your first gas station. It's got a Bojangles and there's a restroom in there. And the basic look of it is they've got air pumps there. They've got the gas station. There's the Bojangles. And we'll come on back around here. Now it's very difficult to get out right there turning left. You see those vehicles turning left. It's hard to cross that road. So what you do is come up on this side and there's usually not a line right there and you can turn right. And unfortunately those folks are still there waiting on the traffic to break. So that's the way you get around that little spot right there. So the new thing in town that has just come in, there used to be an old hop in here on the corner for those of you that are returning Hokies, uh, alumni that are coming back, remember where the hop in was. Well, they tore that down. It stayed empty for a number of years. And then this last year, they built the sheets. And so this is where if you're coming in and you need gas now, you need to get it in the left lane right here because it's going to be right over this corner. And it has electric vehicle hookups. So as you come into town, again, slow down because you're already here. This is the beginning of downtown. Everyone rolling in. Crossing Waller Road right here. Now, here's...
here's where you give up. You can give a left. You've got two choices to get into this. This is the better choice because it doesn't have the light. The light there, if you look forward, you can get into the sheets right there if you want to set and wait on the light. Or you have more of an option once the traffic breaks to go here to turn in. But either way, you can get into the sheets. So here we go. We've got a break in the traffic. Remember, there's where the cleaner world is. And the sheets is over here on the right. And I'll pull back here on the back and let you just have a look at what this looks like. They've got this number of electric pumps. I don't know whether they work in all electric vehicles, but you all would know. You have an electric vehicle. The sheets itself is relatively small inside, but it has everything that you would imagine the sheets would have. And it has plenty of gas pumps right here as well. If you come out, come down to this light and you can orient yourself if you're from Blacksburg where you're at Party Central is there the red carpet inn is there that's been there for a long time As you can see, this road going this way, usually the light runs for a uh, length of a time. It's harder to get these cross lights to get back up on there. That's the reason that if you can find a way, but definitely come down to a light, it's harder to cross traffic when all the students are in town. And, So I want you to notice over on the left, years ago it was where the Lake Terrace Motel was. All of that got tore down and an entire shopping district was built here to the left. And so I'll show you that in a minute. We're back up on the main street that you would have come in from 460 off of the bypass. So right up here are the B&B theaters uh, there's the old lake. We'll ride over there, but you're running parallel to this road. And the uh, last place that I'm going to show you is where the Kroger is. Because those are the main places. If you came into town looking to, and needing gas and wanted to get uh, any kind of things to drink or eat, these are the first three real spots that you have access to that so uh, I won't go all the way downtown at the moment we'll show you where this is the Kroger is going to come up on your left there's a place to eat called the cookout over on the right there's a Dollar Tree over there uh, there's the Oasis Market over there the Good Vibe Shop restaurant on the far end down there. It's a Chinese restaurant. There's Lefty's Main Street Grill right here on the corner. It's a great place to eat. Now, we could have gone up to the light and waited there to go into the Kroger. And instead, we're turning in right here. Because again, to go but depending on the time of the year it may or may not be a good decision 
to not just go to the light. So here we go. Coming here at Lefties, there's a bike shop, and then this is the Kroger complex down through here. And so here on the right are where the gas pumps are. Right up there, honestly, I don't see an electric gas pump here. I've never really looked for one. But there is also a little Subway sandwich shop right here. So if you want to get something to eat, stop in and get gas, uh, need air in your tire, need ice, anything like that that's up here. And then right here, this is a Kroger, and I'm going to go up here just so I can show you. If you had stayed on that road, and you can see you pass the Kroger on your left, if you go straight forward, you're going to go to downtown Blacksburg. And so, you'll see that road, Country Club Road. Here at Country Club Road, you turn this way. This is toward the stadium. And that's down this road. That'll be another video. But for the moment, I'll just land you here at the Kroger. Thank you so much for checking in. I hope you've enjoyed it. I can't wait to meet you on the street and uh, get to see you. And so please look up the Blacksburg Sidewalk stage if you've ever wanted to do any kind of busking or downtown performance. Uh, we have a great opportunity here in Blacksburg. I wish everyone the very best semester that you can have and uh, great success. So look forward to seeing you soon. Bye-bye.